Welcome back. Today I'm cutting a skin fade. I'll be using the Wall 5 Star Senior, the Andis MVP, and the Andis T Outliner. Just so you know, most Andis and Oster detachable blades are interchangeable, and a one and a half Andis blade gives the same cut as a one and a half Oster blade. Now that the top is leveled, let's establish the guideline for the skin fade. We establish the line by closing the adjustable clipper and going around the head. Then we reverse skin fade the section below the line. The reverse skin fade is going to be in a few steps. Going to my detachable clipper and grabbing the 4 ot or 4 o blade. Go just under the line I just made. Then I'm going to grab my Andis T outliner and bald it out underneath all that. If I wanted to, I could use like a shaver, an electric shaver or a razor to even take it lower than this. But it's sufficiently bald, so on to the next level. I'm going to take the plastic one guard, close the clipper and cut a second guideline around the head. Now that I've established a second guideline, I will blend it into the lower section, which I have already skin faded. So I will remove the plastic one guard and use my adjustable clipper from open to close until it blends into the lower skin faded section. Now we only have one more line to blend out. I'm going to reverse fade from the top corner of the head into the section which is faded. I'm going to start with my steel teeth three guard and go to the very top corner, open and close, blend that down. Then I'll go to my steel teeth one guard and blend in the rest. And now I'm going to take the plastic one guard, open it, and cut with the grain along the top corner of the head to take off any loose ends. Cause you shine like one What about the other side of the cut? 